My back end literally went off the cliff there and I just lifted it up and put it back on the trail. Ow. The rock. I've hit my pedal on the side of stuff a lot today. I don't know why. I guess, I think short travel, the bomb bracket is lower. I love this stage though. <laughs> To me, especially on this bike, since I'm running shorter travel, this feels like Windrock. A little less fatiguing on the hands, but still yesterday, by the end of this, and I'm sure today I'll feel it, My, I definitely got some arm pump on it. A little more pedally for sure than would be at Windrock, but a good portion of the first like two thirds of this one is really pure downhill for Arkansas. Just sick. Yes. Feels like I'm actually on a proper. Uh, the H track. I love it. Like this shit is enduro. I'm sure I'm not gonna be saying I love it on the climb to five. That is gonna take like. 45 minutes of pure climbing but at the moment I'm really enjoying this it's pretty sick Put down. that line probably wasn't faster there but we're just here to have fun right so I have a performance tomorrow I gotta save some energy. I'm sure you can tell right now, I'm not going 100%. And you can probably tell because I've been talking this entire time. So, <laughs> dang it. It's fine though. I think I took that yesterday. Woo. Dang it. Starting okay. to feel the hands. I want to make sure, I'm trying to look ahead for wherever that bridge is. Because I need to shift to prepare for that. Because yesterday I came up to it and I was in a terrible gear. I couldn't hit the punchline. That's also another thing that's interesting about this stage is that it's so long and it's just the last quarter of it. I think that's not dad. Um, behind me. That is um, all of a sudden pedaling and climbing. Maybe I didn't. Um, and so you kind of have to gauge like where to use your energy and how much. <sighs> My front end blew there. <laughs> um, you have to gauge how much energy to save so that you can still finish it out. I think we're coming up to it now, soon. I think. I could be completely wrong. This thing is long. Woo! I love manually. Being able to manual is like one of the most fun skills ever. It really just takes practice.
This is awesome. Woo! Full enduro <laughs> on a short travel stumpy. Um, yeah, really <sighs> feeling my legs now and my uh, my hands, mostly my right one, my middle, my ring finger, my middle finger are a little sore. Here we are, shift. Awesome. But yeah, really wish I could just reach down and grab my water right now, but got a lot of stage left, you know? So here we are, on the pedally bit. A little punch climb. Just keep pedaling. That's kind of the thing. As long as you keep, you just gotta keep moving. Go up high. Woo! Yeah. And I think it's basically whew, downhill again. It was just that one second, which isn't too long. But if you're in the wrong gear, then that sucks. Shout out to Session Components. I'm riding on the Session C30 carbon wheel set. Got their six monkey uh, hub, which I'm sure you can hear. Super good engagement at a pretty good price. And I mean like, yeah, I'll say it's not the top, you know, I-9 Onyx for sure has a little better engagement. But in my opinion, from riding these, once you have hubs that are this good of engagement, you aren't really gonna notice as much of a difference moving up oh, to better man. engagement from here. Like, sure, if you're a pro racer, go ahead, but like, these, see that? Pedaling out of corners, not bad. Awesome. Well, that's that stage done and me talking the entire time. Just pretty fun. Woo! Yeah. And now, oh, man. we're at the aid station, which is sick, because I'm almost out of water. Wow. Woo! 